With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. The question is when excess of ethanol is heated with conk H2SO4 at 413 Kelvin, which compound is obtained? Okay. Now we have ethanol, which is CH3, CH2OH, right? Now it is heated with conk H2SO4, that is concentrated H2SO4 at 413 Kelvin. Now, when, when an alcohol is treated with conk H2SO4 and it is heated at this temperature, which is 413 Kelvin, it leads to the formation of an ether, right? It leads to the formation of an ether. So, the ether that will be formed is CH3, CH2, O, CH2, CH3. So, the correct answer is actually ethoxyethane. Ether is formed, right? But when this alcohol will be treated with conk H2SO4 at 443 Kelvin, right? If the temperature is 443 Kelvin, then ethene will be formed in this case, right? Then alkene will be formed. Now, we can also discuss the mechanism of the formation of ether, right? Now, the first step is protonation, right? So, we have CH3, CH2, OH and it gets protonated by the H plus of H2SO4, right? And it forms CH3. CH2O, uh, it forms CH3, CH2O, H, H positive, right? So, this is what is formed. Now, the second step is, now we have another mole of uh, ethanol, right? So two moles of ethanol will be used here. So, this will be CH3, CH2OH and when this will be treated with this CH3, CH2OH plus, OH2 plus, this is CH3, CH2, O, H2 plus. What is going to happen? That this lone pair is going to attack here. This H is going, to, uh, sorry. What is going to happen? Um, this uh, double bond is going to shift somewhere here, right? And this is going to be removed. So, what you will be left with? We will be left with CH3, CH2O positive H, CH2, CH3 along with the formation of water, right? Now, what will be your third step? In the third step, this uh, CH3, CH2, OH positive CH2, CH3, rearrangement is going to take place. This bond is going to shift here and the final product that we are going to obtain is going to be C2H5O, C2H5 which is a diethyl ether or ethoxy ethane, right, along with the uh, liberation of H+. So, this is how the mechanism takes place, right, uh, and the correct answer as we discussed is option C. That's all for the question. For class 6 to 12, ITG and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.